When it comes to EV batteries, there are hundreds of safety tests designed to protect you. But some people think that if a battery passes just one big test, like the nail penetration test, it must be safe. Spoiler alert, it's not that simple. Let's talk about the nail penetration test. It was originally meant to simulate an internal short circuit, but it doesn't really reflect what happens in everyday life. Real-world conditions can be a lot harsher than a single nail poke. And that's why true battery safety isn't about passing just one test. It's about being prepared for anything. At CATL, we've created a testing roadmap that covers every angle. First, we run 136 electrical performance tests. Think of these as a marathon for batteries. We evaluate the battery's output power and energy under various vehicle operating conditions, such as different driving modes. Next, we conduct 75 reliability tests. Whether it's pouring rain, freezing cold, scorching heat, deserts, or jungles, our batteries are designed to keep going no matter what the environment throws at them. Finally, we have 78 safety tests. These simulate the worst case scenarios, from vehicle crash to direct fire exposure. After all, life happens and we want you to feel confident no matter what. We've also read through tons of discussions about EV safety, so we decided to tackle the most common concerns head on and show you how our battery packs perform. You've probably seen videos of EVs catching fire after a crash or from hitting something on the road. It's enough to scare anyone. Let's test for that. Picture hitting a nasty pothole or running over debris. It's not pleasant, right? Well, our pack takes those hits from different angles, and the battery protection plate comes out practically unscathed. A buffer zone is integrated into the bottom of the pack to provide effective cushioning against collisions. We've even added a bulletproof vest to absorb the impact. So whether it's a bumpy road or a rogue rock, our batteries can take it. Now what if there's a serious collision? We crush our battery packs using twice the force required by international standards. The result? No fire, no explosion. That's because we use high-strength steel and aluminum alloy frames, basically giving the cells a suit of armor. Next up, water. We all know gas cars can't handle deep water very well, but with the right protection, EVs can do more than you might think. Suppose your car ends up in a flood. Pretty scary, right? We tested that by submerging the entire pack in about one meter of water for 48 hours. That's IPX8 level waterproofing, fully sealed, no leaks. There's also the issue of thermal runway, which is a fancy way of asking, what if one cell overheats and triggers a chain reaction? We heated a single cell to see if it would cause a chain reaction. It didn't. No fire, no explosion, just a bit of swelling and a warning on our monitor. Our battery pack is engineered with aerospace-grade thermal insulation, liquid cooling, and an innovative exhaust structure, along with advanced protection technology. Even if a single cell enters thermal runway, it won't spread, catch fire, or explode. That's the power of our NP technology. You might have seen reports of EV fires in the news, but a lot of those fires aren't even caused by the battery. Sometimes it's items like lighters or cosmetics inside the car that start the fire. So can our batteries handle that intense heat? We expose them to fire at 800 degrees for more than two minutes. The results, no fire, no explosion. Just more proof of how robust these packs really are. Besides the tests we just mentioned, we also do custom tests on what automakers need, from multi-angle crashes and underbody scraping to extreme temperature trials and full vehicle water immersion. Our goal is always the same, give you peace of mind no matter the circumstance. So there you have it. EV batteries are safer than most people realize, and we hope this look behind the scenes helps put your mind at ease. Thanks for watching, and drive safe.